Yo, what is up guys? It is me and Graffiti here and I am back with another tutorial. In my last one, I showed you that I was having a zone problem where if I were to open any door except for the start zone, um, so zone 2, zone 3, zone 4, etc. Um, zombies would not only spawn in the zone that I opened up next, but they would also spawn in all the zones. So I'm going to teach you how to fix that. Um, I'm going to show you a quick little reference on what I'm what I'm meaning. So I opened up my second door from my start zone in this YouTube video, and when I actually go to buy the next door, um, I have two zombies missing. So I need to buy the next door um, to my zone three, and when I buy it, I go upstairs, and the zombies that should be in zone two are in my zone three and they can show up in any zone it doesn't really matter it just uh, matters if you're having that this problem um, so if you're having this problem I do want to shout out someone named Noah who said that he was having the same problem and that it was because I have more than one trigger on a door and that I only need one flag per trigger um, and so what I was doing is I was actually if we come up in here uh, into our radiant um, I was having uh, a double zone so I was having two triggers so here's the first trigger and if you notice it says open zone 2 and then pretty much I had the same trigger on the other side like this and it was saying um, script flag open start zone not zone 2 so what you want to do is you want to make sure there's only one trigger per door um, why I had two triggers per door was one this is my first time really map doing my own map and two was uh, my brain was thinking that if I were to go the opposite way um, through zone through zone four um, and then go all the way around that when I got back to the start entrance and I bought this door that you would die once you entered this zone and that's not that that's not what happens at all um, so the next thing is what I did was I deleted all of the second flag so I only kept one flag per door so I had two flags on every door that entered a zone so this one had double flags and now there's only one flag on it so on each flag you want to make sure there's only uh, one on each zone that, I mean trigger you want to make sure that there's one flag and that flag needs to be um, uh, opening your zone so here it says open zone three and you want to keep note of all of these flag names so now let's go into your GSC file so the best way to do that is to open up your mod launcher tool right click cryogenic spawn or your map name go to show zone folder and then go to user maps click on your map name and then go to scripts ZM and then click on GSC not CSC so once you open up your GSC you are going to need a script editor so I use sublime which is a nice one um, and if you notice um, here are the new working zones I only have four zones here um, one is my start zone and then another one is a start zone and the only reason why I have two start zones is because I have two doors that enter uh, two zones um, from the start and if you notice the flag is right here which is open zone 2 and open zone 4 open zone 3 and open zone 4 so once you have all of these correct um, it should be fine so if you notice um, let me control Z and this is what it looked like and this was because I had two flags on each door um, or two triggers on each door however you want to say it um, and pretty much what I did was I looked for all the extra zones that was unneeded so if I come to my radiant and here is my zone 3 and out here is my zone 4 if we click on my trigger it says open zone 4 and if we go on the other side it should say open zone 4 as well uh, because it is the same trigger so um, yep so it's make sure it's one trigger so when you buy that door you come out here um, 
and uh, what would happen if you had two if you had a different flag name on it instead of open zone four um, when you if you were to put open zone uh, zone three as if you were making it from the opposite direction um, like coming this way what would happen is when you got into the next zone you would actually die because you have the wrong flag so that one says open zone four so you want to look for the flag that says open zone four and you want to keep that so this is zone three to zone four to open zone four so where it says zone four to zone three open zone three you want to delete that so um, that this is where I was having the main problem was actually because of the script so just make sure you delete that next you want to find the next one so mine would be open zone uh, 2 from start zone so there it is open zone 4 from start zone so there it is um, open zone uh, zone 3 to zone uh, zone 2 to zone 3 so that works right there um, from zone 2 to start zone delete that and zone 4 to start zone delete those so delete these two um, and also right here um, zone 3 to zone 4 open zone 4 we want to keep that one um, but right here zone 3 to zone 2 um, you want to delete that one so now we're back to it you just want to click file save um, and uh, when you were to actually uh, if you were to open up your tools your mod launcher and you were to click compile link I don't need a compile link um, because I've already done it and just click run and everything should work fine now um, if I were to load up the map right now uh, which it's doing it should work just fine so let's just hurry up and get into it and once this loads I'll show you that everything is working fine now and I am no longer having the issue. Um, so we start the game, we open up the second zone uh, before all the zombies spawn in. So we got six zombies. So if you notice in the last one, they were actually behind that door, uh, the last two were. So I'm going to just kill some of these zombies. And if you notice, they're all spawning in zone two, like they should. Um, I was also having that error. They were spawning in zone two, but the last ones were also in a different zone. But if you notice, uh, that is not the case anymore. It is now fixed. They all spawn in the correct zone. So if I were to just exit out of this, we are all done guys so that is all um, if you guys like this tutorial and if this helped you out please leave a like comment and a sub if y'all having any other problems I can try to help you out but um, that's about all guys so peace out and keep on mapping